Today, we're gonna to be ranking all of the agent select animations from worst to best. Let's go. The worst one is gonna be Breach. He's number 18. I mean, he's pretty much just flexing like he's Arnold Schwarzenegger or something. He's really not doing a whole lot. He looks kind of lame. He's got that little smirk, makes him look a little cute. But otherwise, I mean, this is definitely the worst one. Next is gonna be everyone's Valorant daddy, Brimmy. Um, and you know, he just kind of poses like he's some sort of like drill sergeant or something. I feel like I'm about to get yelled at and like relive past childhood trauma. I really don't want that, so that's why he's the next worst on the list. In comes Sova next up. I mean, he's kind of looking like Legolas here, honestly, which is pretty cool, but he really doesn't do a whole lot. He just draws out his bow and just stares at you. He's literally just looking straight into my soul. Really not that cool. Moving on. Sage over here, I mean, she's playing with like a little tiny blue ball. And honestly, like it looks pretty cool. The animations are pretty neat. I think the glowing effect looks pretty nice. It doesn't really do a whole lot, but I mean, it's better than the previous ones. All right, this is where the animations start getting actually kind of cool. The fire effect here with Phoenix looks pretty dope. And we see him kind of go backwards like this and just pop out of nowhere. And then he snaps his finger and then creates a red fireball. You know, and comparing this one to Sage's ball, honestly, he's just going to melt her ball. So, like, that's why his ball is a lot better than her ball. Reyna's next, and she's looking pretty cool in her Empress form. And then look at this. She just pulls us right towards the camera, and then she, like, smells our body odor or something. I don't know. It's really creepy, but overall, it looks really cool, and I'm a little bit scared. And next up, we got Killjoy. I think hers is really nice. You know, she conjures up her little robot thing, looks at the other robot thing, and kind of smiles at it, and then looks at the camera, and it's really cute and stuff. So in comes Ray's, and honestly, she has some sort of issue with like making things explode and everything, but the explosions actually look really cool. They have nice colors and it matches her outfit. I don't know if that was intentional, but it looks really nice aesthetically. And also it's just really cool that she's just like naive and caring about the explosion and just jamming out to Mozart. In comes Neon running to save the day as she dips and slides and weaves and bobs and dashes and does her electricity thing. Honestly, the effects look really cool. And I think overall, just the colors are neat. Here comes Jet literally just dashing in and I think it's so cool because like right here you can see like the wind just like blows past her as she stops already just really showing off her speed feet. I just want to see her like race Goku or like the Flash or something to see who's truly faster at dashing. In comes Cypher and this is like really weird because like the reflection right there is not at all what we see in the actual game of Valorant and that's like static so I actually don't even know what exactly we're looking at here but it looks really cool. Next is Skies and you know I mean she has this really cool dog that's made out of grass and light and then sucks you in just like Reyna does but she sucks you in because she wants to heal you so that's pretty dope. Here's Viper. I'm not sure if this is a fart or some sort of uh, vape cloud that has green food coloring in it, but honestly, it looks pretty cool. It's just really smoky. Just like Neil Armstrong, one small step for man, but one giant leap for mankind. Here comes Yoru stepping out of the dimensional drift, and he's got the cool Rasengan looking flash. Releasing a fart he's held in for decades, here comes Omen just blasting in from some other dimension as well as Yoru, but he comes in, I think, way more flashy, he looks really cool, he looks like Goku trying to go Super Saiyan 3 for the first time. Here comes Astra, literally just covered all over with space goop. Whatever this purple stuff is, I really don't know, it's like an astral form or something, it doesn't make a lot of sense to me. But it looks freaking sweet dude, like I want an anime made out of this cutscene right here. Chamber looking like James Bond over here. This is really cool. So check this out. His gun just turns into a face tattoo and then like Yugi, he pulls out Exodia and he's ready to take on the world because he believes in the heart of the cards. However, the number one spot has got to go to KL. Look at this dude. Beautiful. So cool. The colors, the fists together, the one, two, three, four dots, little bro fist there and turns into his face. He's got a shotgun acting like he's all ready to go, like drop it in some Fortnite or something. But the twist is he's actually a Valorant agent, so he's not going to be in Fortnite, or at least I don't think he will be. I don't know. Fortnite kind of has like everyone now, so I wouldn't be surprised if we see KO there. Comment below. Let me know what you thought of this list. Definitely click the like button, uh, subscribe, click the bell notification so you know when I upload videos and also come hang out at one of my streams. I stream like two to three times on YouTube here. I stream Valorant, sometimes Lost Ark. It'd be super cool to see you guys there. Um, let's see. I think that's all. So uh, take it easy.